2015 Ford Transit, high roof version and extended with dual wheels in the back. I'll do a quick walk around and then go through the interior. So walking in, you've got this step here, welcome mat, welcoming you into the van. We've got a shower, not super common in vans like these, but we really like ours. The head works really well. And then you've got this door. which is also self-squeegeeing door. When you close it, this roller over here acts as a squeegee and cleans itself. This is the main living area. We have the fridge here. Pulls out opens up. This is the light switch and this controls the fans. We have two fans, one in the front and one in the back, which really helps create a wind tunnel in the van. Perfect on hot days. There's tons of storage space. Here, on the other side, this cabinet, this tall cabinet here. With a mirror or two, which comes in handy quite often. Paper towel rack right here, and of course the sink. This switch turns the power on for the water. This is our Wi-Fi device. Again, more storage, tons of storage, trash can under there, and the water heater underneath there as well. These latches are nice because they keep the door shut while you're driving. And these ones have little clips to keep them in place while driving. More storage here. We've got this drawer type thing where we store our camping stove. We've got bear mace here also. And then of course more storage here on the other side as well. This is the bed slash table. Um, right now it's in table mode, obviously, and um, you can press down the table and make it into bed mode as well. In this clip, you can see that the tabletop has been pressed down into bed mode and the bed is made here. This clip is from when we took a trip to Acadia National Park. This is the table slash bed in bed mode, just without the cushions. I'm gonna show you where there's more storage space in this section and this section. So over here, You've got, as you can see, tons of space running all the way down the length of the bed. And then on this side, you have our water tank there, this fresh water tank, and then you have more storage space over here as well. We also have this outdoor table, which comes out. Perfect for cooking on or eating on in the national parks. Looking at the van from the back, you've got on the bottom section, this is what we call the garage, uh, some extra storage space, put our camping gear back here and whatnot. 
Just giving a bit of a close up on the battery pack. We've got a fire alarm back there just in case. Another remote control for the fan. This is the fuse box for all of the power. This is the battery and the battery bank. Um, and of course these plugs um, are plugging in our fridge. Um, this extension cord which we use to plug in our laptops. Um, and the water heater also. This, uh, which we're actually not selling with the van, is a Wi-Fi booster, or uh, cell phone signal booster. It works really, really well. This hose here is for filling the water tank, which are inside of these benches. The doors open up nearly 180 degrees, which is really nice. You can open them up 90 degrees to here for everyday use, but when you want them to be really wide open, you can push them out all the way. These are the blackout curtains that we have for all the windows. They're super nice because they block out 100% of the light in and out, so you have some privacy and you can't see out of them. They block sound, they provide insulation. We have these blackout curtains for both of the back doors and also this side door as well. Now going into the cab, we have another curtain right here, which is really nice. Blocks out again 100% of the light. They have magnets on them so they stick together really easily. And you're good to go. They have privacy inside. This is the cab of the vehicle. Pretty spacious in here. You've got this overhead storage bin, which is super nice. Nice leather seats that are still in amazing condition. Like I said, this is a 2015. Very nice cab area. This van has seen so much in the past year. From the East Coast to the West Coast, this van has taken us full circle around the US, and during that time, one full trip around the sun. But now, it's your turn to take it for a spin and enjoy the van life. That's really what this community is all about. We never really own this van. We merely have been looking after it for the next van lifers to use. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the tour.